In this video, we'll look at ways to get a Dakota Digital Instrument System up and running with a late model drivetrain, specifically focusing on OBD2 CAN interfacing with GM, LS, and LT applications. So you took the plunge, put a late model engine transmission combination in your project vehicle, but now the burning question in your mind is, how do you get a good looking quality set of instrumentation in the vehicle that not only speaks the language of a late model drivetrain, but looks the part in the interior? Enter Dakota Digital and our extensive lineup of universal and direct fit instrument systems. These packages offer the latest in technology, OBD2 CAN interfacing, but do not look out of place in a classic car. There are two ways to get information into an instrument system with a late model drivetrain. First is install the supplied sending units in the engine, or second, a direct connection to the ECM. All Dakota Digital instrument systems include solid state sending units for coolant temperature and oil pressure. Each of these senders have 8th inch pipe thread connections and the kits are supplied with 12 mm and 16 mm bushings to adapt to an LS style engine. Since the ECM still needs to monitor some of these functions, you'll end up having two sending units, one for the computer and one for the instrument system. The message centers in the complete instrument systems are able to display a wide variety of readings, starting with essentials such as odometer and trip meters, but also all six main gauge readings and performance data in addition to any auxiliary information available through the ECM. Connecting to the DLC offers multiple benefits. First, a shorter installation time, no new sensors to install. Second, a cleaner finished product, you don't have extra harnesses and wires to try to hide. And third, additional information, plugging into the DLC often gets transmission temperature, gear position, as well as intake air temp. If you're using a GM ECM, your harness should have a diagnostic port, also known as the DLC. That's the 12 pin plug where you connect a scan tool or programmer. The DLC is a direct connection to the ECM, allowing our BIM 01 2 to request data and provide it to your Dakota Digital Instrument System. A supplied cable connects the DLC directly to the BIM module. The final link is plugging the supplied harness into the BIM module and then into the auxiliary I.O. port on the main instrument system control box. Both cables need to be connected at all times to provide data to your instruments. Unplugging the BIM-01-2 won't lose any settings, but it does break the data feed, so the instrument readings from the ECM will not work while disconnected. Ultimately, the decision is yours. Installing dedicated sending units in conjunction with the factory pieces or going high-tech and plugging directly into the computer to utilize the information at hand. Dakota Digital has what you need to bring your classic into the 21st century and look good doing it.